I was sent a lens in the mail to review the Apexel. Let's go. Kwame from New York here, photographer in Manhattan since the 1970s. This is photo class number 381. Thumbs up, subscribe, comment below if you've ever used a macro lens on your cell phone. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have been sent this gorgeous macro lens from the Apexel Corporation. Now, this is the Apexel Zoom Macro Lens for your smartphone, model APL-ZM100. They sent me this lens to give my full honest review. And I have to tell you, just opening the box, the build quality of this all metal lens, it has uh, three elements, all glass elements. This is the zoom ring right here. And as you can see, it zooms in and out, right? This is for macro photography. Now, just go over a few specifications. It's an f1.05 aperture, nice and wide. Uh, it's multi-coated, as you can see in the reflection. There you go. You can see it's multi-coated. Uh, the focusing distance from the lens to your subject is 15 millimeters to 45 millimeters. Now, here's what I found very interesting. This zoom lens for your cell phone, which is for macro photography, accepts 52 millimeter filters. It doesn't come with a filter, but that leaves the door open for you to pick any kind of filter if you want. It's not necessary, but if you want to put a filter on this macro lens, you can. In this case, I put on a 52 millimeter UV filter. But just think of all of the options that you have to put on uh, the front of this lens. How many different filter options from neutral density to ultraviolet and beyond. Okay, now. It comes with this bracket that expands, right? It's on springs, which clips on to your phone. We'll get to that in a minute. But I want to show you something else. The lens very simply screws onto the bracket. Okay, that's the rear element. That's the front element. And this is the bracket. Now, because cell phones, right, have their camera lens in different places this is a samsung by the way right because the the main taking lens of your cell phone is in different spots once you clip it on right like this you simply adjust it right by pushing it up to the lens area and then it has this screw on the top that you can adjust left and right to get the opening for the rear element dead center on your cell phone. All right, so let me just adjust that like that and bring that up. Okay, and you just tighten the screw and then you take the 
Apexel zoom macro lens and you just screw it on to the holder, which is uh, very tightly onto your cell phone. It won't come loose. Okay, you make that nice and tight. And then you can see the finger knurling on the lens to operate the zoom feature. Okay, as you zoom in and out. It's, and the best part is it gives you the opportunity to take not only still macro photographs, but video macro <clears throat> videography, okay? So uh, let's continue. Before we get to the photographs that I took with this gorgeous lens, let me just show you something else. They thought of a lot of different options for this lens, okay? It comes with a nice soft uh, carrying pouch, okay? It comes with a lens cleaning cloth, but here's what I like. This is the rear element. It comes with this rubber eye cup that you simply put on the back. Okay, and now it's a loop that you can put right up to your eye and use for close-up inspection. If you're a jeweler, right? Ooh, nice and close. Okay, so it comes with the eye cup to transform your macro photography lens into a loop okay so we'll put this back on the camera and while i'm doing this let's look at the photographs that this lens on this camera took and some macro photography videos as well here we go mm -hmm. 